Hey girl, welcome back to another video. If you are new here, my name is Cheryl and on this channel we talk about fashion, beauty, and lifestyle. So if you are interested in any of those things, please consider subscribing and hitting that notification bell so you don't miss another video. <music> back for another series of what did I wear this week. I started this new series last week so we are in week two and I am excited to bring to you guys another week of what did I wear. This week again we're starting off with Tuesday because Monday I had a couple of doctor appointments and obviously I was running late so I didn't have time to like film and shoot what I was wearing that day because I just needed to run out to the doctor's office but I did wear like a little jumpsuit because I needed to just be comfortable um I didn't know if I was gonna have to remove my clothes or anything like that so I just wanted to wear something that was easy and comfortable for those two appointments so sorry Monday did not make it to the video again we will work really really hard to get Monday at it next week so let's go ahead and jump into Tuesday so I will say I find that I don't wear dresses a lot so I was very intentional when picking out my clothes for the week this week I was like sure you need to start wearing dresses more so every look this week will be a dress. So I do have my phone here because that's the only way I'm going to remember what I wore. So for Tuesday, I did wear this black sweater dress from Banana Republic. I love this dress, y'all. This dress is so sexy. So I love the neck part of the dress. It's kind of like a off the shoulder situation but it's not so drastic where it's like exposing your whole left side or anything like that it's just a very subtle like a little peekaboo moment so i love the neckline and then i also love the way that it is kind of oversized at the top so it kind of folds over the skirt portion and it makes it like it's a two-piece but it's really a one-piece so i love that um look of the oversized top and the fitted bottom and the sleeves the sleeves are everything. I love how at the top, like from the elbow up to the shoulder, it's a little loose and relaxed fit. But then from the shoulder down to the wrist area, it is a more fitted. It just adds some dramatics to the outfit. So I really, really love that. And then the dress does come just above my knee, just barely above my knee. So it's a really good length for me to wear to work. So this is a beautiful, beautiful version of a sweater dress. It's not too tight where it's just like showing all your bumps and curves and dents and all that is not that tight I don't even like to wear my dresses that tight but it's just nice and form-fitting just a very well-made dress I love this dress unfortunately it is no longer available on Banana Republic I actually went back to check before I started filming this video and it's no longer available which I'm so sad because it came in I know about five or six colors and I was really thinking like I should go get this in another color but unfortunately it's no longer available and I think I may have purchased this two or three years ago but I do want to say there is a another designer by the name of Reese I think you can find that at Nordstrom's um Saks Fifth Neiman's and places like that and they have the exact same dress obviously the price point is a lot higher but the idea of the dress is the same so with this sweater dress I am wearing it with some leopard tights that I picked up from Amazon and y'all oh my gosh gorgeous it is so gorgeous so of course, summertime and tights let's talk about it I would definitely do it I will definitely do it because it's not as warm as you think it might be especially with these tights because they're like that fishnet design so you have that airflow that comes in so you're not just sitting there enclosed and like some thick tights that you're gonna wear in winter time. It's nothing like that. And I actually got this look with the tights from a lady at my job. She wears tights like every single day cause she loves to wear dresses and she just, I love the way she dresses. I mean, her heels, her outfits, it, it just looks so, so good. I was like, I need to add, I need to bring that into my wardrobe. I need to bring that into my styling. So I just love the way tights look with a dress and with a skirt. So I will definitely be wearing more dresses with tights, even in the summertime. 
on and then I am wearing my black Valentino Rockstas. We're not going to even talk about those. You already know how I feel about those shoes. So that was the outfit for Tuesday. We did go into the office that day. So of course we needed to be dressed up and a work appropriate. So okay for Wednesday it was another in the office day and again we are wearing a dress. So I wanted to wear this really cute fun and flirty dress and I purchased this dress from Boohoo and so as you can see it's black but then it has like the purple flowers and then it has some white in it and I wanted to cinch it in the waist a little bit. It did come with a belt but I didn't like the belt that it came with so I decided to wear my own belt with it and I am wearing my black coach belt with the silver buckle so I paired that together and I thought that it looked really nice and another pair of tights and these have the floral design on them and I'm wearing these with my black patent leather ankle pumps from DSW so I thought this was a really really cute um fun look so the dress is a little short so i do think the tights help to kind of like tone it down a little bit so you're not just seeing legs and like why is that girl wearing that mini dress to work it was just a really really cute dress i think it was warm on that day maybe like in the high 80s so it's really really nice and breathable and lightweight dress for me to wear um on that warmer day but it doesn't even matter because even when it's hot outside it's always freezing in our building i don't know what's going on with the hvac system so most of the time I have to dress for one at a time anyway when I'm inside the office otherwise I would be freezing but I was pretty pretty comfortable in this dress on that day so that is our look for Wednesday let's move on to Thursday so for Thursday that is my work from home day because I only go into the office two days a week so on Thursday we're going to keep it really chill and really comfortable I think I needed to run out and do like a couple of errands so I needed to put on something and plus I said I'm trying to be intentional about getting dressed each and every day and not working in my pajamas so I wanted to uh, put on something that was a little cute and comfortable so I have this army green dress that I picked up from Walmart I think last summer and I just love the way it just flows I love the length of it I love the little collar detail with the button so I'm wearing this dress and I paired it with these dad sandals also from Walmart and this was I didn't do any tights or anything like that because um, I was working from home that day and wasn't really going anywhere. So we just kept it really, really casual and comfortable. So that was the look for Thursday. Let's move on to Friday. So for Friday, I was actually off today. It was my work from home day, but I was actually off today because I needed to burn through some annual leave that I have. So I was taking the next, you know, few Fridays off. So on this Friday, I decided that I wanted to go to the mall and do a couple of returns. And so I wanted to, you know, dress up a little bit, still be casual, but elevated a little bit. So I am wearing this white classic button down shirt dress. And I actually picked this dress up from Shein. Can you believe it? And it is such good quality. Like this is the perfect shirt dress that you can wear in the fall time because the material is so thick. And it was perfect for today because it was raining and cold again and i felt like it was raining and cold last weekend as well so um with this white shirt dress i just paired it with a pair of white adidas because again i wanted to keep it comfortable and casual because i knew i was going to the mall and i was going to be doing a lot of walking and i just wanted to be comfortable i did not want to be bothered with anybody's heels on this day and I did roll up the sleeves because it is a little oversized and you know me I, I'm gonna roll up the sleeves anyway and that's what I did with this and this shirt dress is a little oversized which is perfect for me because I don't want my shirt dresses to fit like sweater dresses like I don't want them to be tight and hugging on my body I want the, I just want them to be able to flow and to move and just not tight and restrictive on my body so I love the way that it Fit. I love the length of it is long enough it's not too short so that when I'm sitting down you can see all of my business it is just the perfect length I just love this so if you want it to you can even put a belt around the waist and cinch it in a little bit that would be a good look if you wanted to wear this in the fall you can put on some over knee boots with it that would be perfect you could wear like a vest over it or a sweater over it. it's just so many different things that you could do with a shirt dress especially a white classic shirt dress so I feel like every woman get your pen get your paper take these notes every woman should have a classic white button-down shirt in their closet and they should have a classic white button-down shirt dress so if you don't have 
anything else in your closet make sure you have those two pieces because they are so versatile you can wear them with so many different outfits you can give them so many different looks so make sure you write that down go out and get you a white button down shirt and a white button down shirt dress you need those okay class is over <laughs> no but that brings us to the end of this video those are my looks for the week please come back next week to see what i decide to wear again i don't know will i be wearing more dresses or will i go back to my pants who knows we will see but before you leave don't forget to like comment and subscribe and i will see you in my next video bye